Denny's CEO, John Miller, is working to take the nearly 1,700 unit chain that is 60 years old this year to new heights. Focusing on menu innovation, value, and marketing, Denny's is ready to take on a whole new stride. John, two years of testing, a big investment, and new equipment, all for coffee. Talk to us a little bit about why coffee was such an important undertaking for Denny's today. Well, as you pointed out a while ago, this is our 60th anniversary. And we were born as a coffee and donut shop. So by the early 60s, you look back and, and Denny's is America's diner. It's where families went out to dine. And it was a coffee shop. A lot of people referred to family dining or places like Denny's as a coffee shop. One of every, of every three beverages we sell is a cup of coffee. And our customers are saying it's OK. And OK just wasn't good enough. So we, we felt like we needed to step up and offer what other uh, brand new brands are offering out there for their consumer. Denny's introduced and was very successful with its 2468 menu, but just announced a new program that tweaks it a bit and gives a full meal for $8.99. Tell me about value pricing and what that means to Denny's and also how you are tweaking these pricing packages today. Right now, our 2468 value menu runs anywhere from 16 to 18 percent incidence rate. So clearly it's a big part of our overall daily transactions. This year we're doing a bundled meal program with nine different skillets, like a, a, a Philly or a prime rib and loaded potato skillet, for example. But you start with either a soup, salad, or fruit, then one of the nine skillets, and then finish with a series of mini desserts that are now available for $8.99, every market, 50 states. It's a great deal. And then bear in mind, our 2468 value menu, the $8 entrees include a beverage. How is Denny's working to take market share? And also, what are you looking at from a cost perspective to protect those margins as you continue to drive traffic? First, it's important to hold share, right? Then from there, you want to grow share. And obviously, the value proposition for a diner, we believe that's the promise of a diner, not to have to shop price, to have everyday value. But then also, beyond that, obviously, there's a lot of consumers that never touch that end of the menu. They define value differently in taste or quality or options or choice. And so fit fair options, broadening the menu with more and more healthy choices, and then being very good at it. Clearly, if there are things that don't meet the standard the customer's looking for, they don't mix well, get them off the menu. If there's things that um, you know, don't get the score, don't build intent to reorder, and, but they're important to keep on the menu, you got to reinvest in that. If you do, you got to find offsets somewhere else. You got to build transactions or find some other places where you can tighten up. So the ability to keep that whole margin per guest growing, but the value score and intent to return growing at the same time, that's the trick. John, thank you very much, and good luck with Denny's 60th year. Thank you very much. Thank you. Crunch Time has been great to work with. I've seen a lot of food cost systems out there and I really believe Crunch Time is the best program out there. Using Crunch Time has helped the cafes be able to fine tune their food costs. They've been able to move their variance to theoretical a couple percentage points in a very short period of time. Our managers follow the task list. They're able to see what is due that day if they have to place an order to reconcile orders. Area directors are able to follow up on our cafe managers. Invoicing is much faster and easier for them, and taking inventories is night and day to what they were doing before. Crunch time has definitely changed the way we do things around here in the sense of we're more disciplined. We have the cafe managers more disciplined where they look at their inventories, they look at their variances on a weekly basis, and they're accountable for the results. Our cafe managers love the program. It's easy to use, it's intuitive for them, so it makes them much more efficient. They spend less time in the back office on the computer. They're able to spend more time on the floor with our guests doing what they need to do.